Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley, if you guys are new here. And for today's video, I'm doing an apartment tour. So I have moved to a new apartment for my junior year and I'm also intending on staying here for my senior year and I'm super excited. I love it here. I have just one roommate and we both kind of decorated a place to our likings. It is, we haven't even been here for a month. Like we've been here for like what, two and a half weeks. So it's not completely done, but I figure as the years go by, we'd obviously will decorate a little bit more, but I wanted to give you guys a little tour and yeah, I hope that you guys will enjoy it. If you do, give this video a thumbs up. I make videos on about college, fitness, lifestyle. I'm a nursing major, so I'm trying to make videos about nursing. I haven't really filmed any days in the lives because I think it's pretty boring to watch a day in my life of a virtual school, but let me know if you guys will be interested. And without further ado, let's just go ahead and get started. So when you walk into our apartment, this is what you will see. So I'm gonna turn around, you guys can see the little entryway a little bit more. My old apartment, we did not have an entryway. And it's really nice to kind of just have a place they can walk through, I don't know. So um, first, let's start with this rug. This rug is from Ikea. I will say it's probably a bad idea because it's a really light color and it has fringe. So fringe is really hard to clean. And the rug is getting dirty, especially with maintenance coming in here with their dirty boots. <laughs> so. I don't know. I like it, but it's kind of getting messy. I've already cleaned it once and it kind of messed up the fringe a little bit. So, and I'm a little weary about that, but whatever. That's from Ikea. This is perfect for the entryway though, because it was really thin. So the door opening didn't move the rug too much. So that's why I got it, but I don't know. Then to the right of the door, when you walk in, you have a little closet. I put a lot of my stuff in here because my closet is a little bit smaller than my roommate's and you know I still have space for her if she wanted to put anything in here but this is where we have like our broom, vacuum cleaner, and my steamer in here. That's my pull up bar because I brought it from my mom's house and I just put it in here so if I wanted to use it ever if gyms close again or something I have it and then I have all of my Sherpa jackets in here because they were taking up a lot of space in my closet so I have like my big winter coats and my Sherpas and stuff and then at the very top, I have like my laundry stuff. So that's my laundry soap, laundry stuff, and then just some water in there. So that is this closet. And the AC is turning on, yay. Then my roommate put her desk out here because she didn't have space for it in her room. Um, honestly, I don't know if I like the whole setup here. I just randomly put that stuff there and I don't really know if it matches. I don't think it does, but my roommate got those. I don't know where she got them from, but she got those and then she has this sign that says, God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, courage to change things I can, and wisdom to know the difference. So that was really cute. I think it's like really neutral colors. So I think the home in this matches, but that little wreath thing I just put there and I don't think it matches. Okay, then this is the front door can't open that door that has like the AC unit or whatever in there and then this is our laundry room which I actually like that it's just a stackable so it just takes up less space I was doing laundry but then I paused it so you guys wouldn't hear it but that is the laundry room we have our trash can right here y'all um, I really wanted to get a stainless steel trash can so I got this from Home Depot usually stainless steel trash cans are really expensive Luckily, this one was like 35 bucks, which is not good. I mean, this is not bad for like a stainless steel trash can, but it needed to match the appliances. <laughs> okay, and then this is our kitchen. We just have like a little wall of kitchen. I was kind of nervous about that, but it honestly has been working for us. So this is our fridge. These are all my magnets. I like to collect magnets from places where I've been. Um, nothing spectacular in here. We got the freezer. I got these cute little... Um, guys freezer thingies whatever they're called for my lunchbox or for my backpack from amazon because i needed some <laughs> and then um this is our fridge my stuff is on the left over here and her stuff is on the right i don't know pretty empty still i do like down here though, on the very bottom of the fridge there's like a perfect size of place for drinks so i just have some drinks down here honestly those two sodas are my boyfriend's and i just put them in here so when he comes back when he comes back he can have them but um, I don't really have drinks besides water, but if you did, this would be a good place for them. Okay, and then this side of the kitchen is my side of the kitchen. So our setup here, up here I just have my like 
plates and molds and stuff. Honestly, I could have organized it better because I'm not using the top shelf because I'm kind of too short to reach up there and I might reorganize everything eventually, but this is what it's looking, uh, what it's looking like right now. And then over here, I just have my food. <sighs> um, this is like the stuff I use pretty often. And then I have a whole like drawer full of snacks, which I will show you guys in a second. We have my paper towels here, a little um, waffle hour from Bath and Body Works. I did get these lights from Target to kind of light up the space whenever it's dark at night. That's my roommate's air fryer. I did have one, but mine broke, so she said I can use hers. And then this is my brown sugar for my oatmeal. I just have it in that. Then this drawer has some stuff in it, um, Ziploc bags, aluminum foil, gloves, um, stuff like that. And then down here is where I keep my pots and pans. And then I have also like, this is cereal, chips, stuff like that. Some food back there. We have our dishwasher. And this is our sink. I really like it. Oh my God, this plant from TJ Maxx or Home Goods. And then these are also from, I think TJ Maxx or Home Goods. It was like a double store. But those were cute. Um, this sign right here is from Hobby Lobby. My roommate put it up. It looks super cute. This was like an empty space, so it looked really cute there. And then up here, I have my supplements, which I'm kind of too short to reach, but I just kind of made it work. So I don't use my supplements very often, so I just put them all up there. Then, if, I know you guys might not care about this, but I feel like some people are nosy, so I'm just gonna show you guys. So in here, we have our silverware. This drawer is like my roommate stuff, and then down here I have like all of my utensils and stuff. Literally just thrown in there. I really don't care, honestly. Then, this rug right here is from Ross. Super cute, and it's perfect right here. And then we have underneath the sink. I don't know why I'm showing you guys that. It's simple stuff. And then this is our stove and our microwave. This is my roommate stuff over here. Um, my Keurig. And then, uh, um, yeah. And then over here is where I have my coffee cart. I kind of want to get a sign right here that has something about coffee. Um, I did have to try to fit my Keurig on there, but it did not fit. So I had to put it on the counter. But this is what it looks like. So I have like on top my coffee grinder, my beans, my stuff for my cold brew, my little frother, which does not work right now, straws, um, liquid cane sugar. Then I have some mugs down there. And then some just stuff down there. I'm gonna try and make it cuter. It's not super cute right now, but it just does the job. Then this is our kitchen table. Circle, um, two chairs. I wish there was more, but honestly, there's only two of us and it's fine. This little thing, the flowers were from Home Goods and TJ Maxx, and then something with this. And then this thing I DIY'd. I will try and link a video down below, but um, I'm trying to fix it because I didn't cut everything evenly, so. One of these days I'll go back and fix that. I've fixed it twice already and it's still not perfect. <laughs> then over here is our living room. Our house is really open concept, which I am loving. So I start with the living room. Obviously this place was furnished, so all the furniture came with the house pretty much. If I didn't, I'll let you guys know. But this is my roommate's TV. We're working on getting a fire stick or something so that we can watch YouTube or Netflix in here. Right now it's just a TV that never gets used. <laughs> Then under the TV stand, we have some baskets. Um, these ones, the wired ones, are from the container store, and then these little baskets are from Target. These are currently empty, but I feel like as we live here a little bit longer, they might get filled with some games or something like that. Then, um, this is our coffee table. I got this little basket from the Goodwill, and then I have like, a book in there and our remote for our TV. And this corner over here is where we have our lamp. This lamp I got from Ikea, and then I have a little poof, which is from TJ Maxx. Um, the rug is from Rugs USA. It used, used to be, if you guys watched my videos um, last year, this used to be my old room, but we have carpets in our room now, so I didn't really want to put it in there, and it looks really good in the living room. These couches are super comfy. This couch, this pillow is from um, Kohl's from the what is it called? Property Brothers line. And then those pink ones my sister gave me, so I'm not sure where they're from. And then this blanket is from like TJ Maxx or something like that. And then this pillow is from Target. And we have a little fake aloe plant over here in a little basket. I don't know where that's from. Probably like TJ Maxx or Home Goods. <laughs> and then another little light over here. Then over here we have my mass moss. I think it's mass cane. Um, that I'm not taking care of because I 
forget to water it. I'm not sure if it has the right soil, but it looks fine. I repotted it and it was a struggle, but I mean, it looks okay now. <laughs> and then this little thing right here is from Ikea. So um, we bought the cat, this is a Calyx shelf with eight little cubes. And then these little doors came with it. And then the, the little bottom baskets I got from Target. And I got new knobs for those because the knobs were really ugly. <laughs> and I'll show you guys what's in there in a second. But above that I have, she believes she could. So she did. This used to be above my bed in my room, but I upgraded. And so those are from Hobby Lobby. Um, that little wax warmer is from uh, Amazon. Let me know if you guys keep those on all the time. I feel like I want to so it smells good in here. But also I feel like I can't smell the wax anymore. So let me know if you guys keep those on. And the next two, I just have a little fake snake plant from like Michael's or something like that. So let me guys, so I'm going to show you guys what's in here. I did keep some empty for my roommate to put stuff in there. And then she never did. So I just kind of put my stuff in there. But if she wants to put stuff in here, she can. I can just move my stuff because it's not um, super important. So here, I did have my air fryer in here, but I threw her away because she broke. But I have my George Foreman grill and then my Ninja. And then in this one, I have my crock pot and my little mini waffle maker. Over here, we just have some extra Walmart bags or anything like that. I just throw them in here. And then in this last one, I have like cleaning supplies. So my cousin actually sent me a lot of cleaning stuff, which I'm super grateful for. So I have like sprays, wipes, magic erasers, Lysol spray. And then I also have my Scentsy Pods in here, so um, these little things that go in the wax melt. Um, I actually um, melted a candle and poured it in here because one of my candles broke, so that's what that is. This is like a silicone um, ice cube tray, which I got from Target. And here's an up-close look of those new little pools. They're super cute. And then this one basically just has my hydro dark in here. Like I said, I can take it out if my roommate wants to put stuff in here. And then here we have our paper towels. This is my snack drawer. Um, honestly, my boyfriend came and he brought a lot of snacks. So a lot of these snacks are his. And I just threw them in here because he didn't eat them and he left them on purpose for me, which I'm not going to eat. But when he's back, he can have some of those. <laughs> and then here I have like my lunchbox, my toaster, some extra stuff in there. Okay, and I think that was everything. So over here is my roommate's room, and then over here is my room. So first, let me show you guys my little door. So I actually made this on my door. So I got the letter from Hobby Lobby, and then the eucalyptus is from Target, and I just cut it up and then wrapped it around with some twine. I stained the letter a little bit darker because it was a little bit lighter of a wood, and it looks super cute and I'll tell you guys where I took inspiration from because <laughs> I copied something in my room so walking in my room this is what you see Ooh, I love it so that's where I what I copied basically for my letter on my door but let's start with my bed so this is my bed my comforter is from Target I think I got it a couple years ago so I'm not sure <laughs> and then I have this pillow just from home goods or TJ Maxx these two big pillows back here are from Target, and then this third blanket is from Ikea. So that is what my bed looks like. Above my bed, I have these two frames, which I got from Kohl's. Um, you might notice that one of them is kind of coming off the wall. Both of them actually are. It's because whenever I moved, I had them in my trunk, and they weren't flat, so they got bent, and I cannot bend them back. So I just hung them up and said, F it, it's fine. But yeah, that is my bed. And then I guess in front of my bed, I have my little TV stand. I did not have a TV in my old room because there was really no good place to put it. But in this apartment, there was, which is super exciting. So this is from Target, the whole stand. You can also get something like that from Ikea. But the drawers I have are from Ikea. Again, the new knobs are on these. And then um, I have my TV here. I have a Bath and Body Works candle lit. This is Welcome Home. I was a little skeptical because the scent description was amazing. I got it online during their sale. And then I smelled it when I got it and it didn't smell good. But now that it's lit, guys, it smells so good. Get you this candle. It just smells like home. It's so good. But yeah, on the side of my TV stand, I actually have my masks here and my badge for school. I did have another one here for my keys. My keys kept falling because they were too heavy. So I just said whatever and I just put them somewhere else. 
So above my TV stand, I have this little cute little sunburst rattan mirror. This is actually nice because it's a mirror, but it's not as heavy as a mirror, so it's easier to hang without like screwing holes into the wall. And this is from TJ Maxx. And then here, I just have stuff in here. So like in the bottom too, I have clothes and then I have like socks and underwear, like school stuff in here. That one has scrunchies in it, which is hard to open, but this one has like pills and just random stuff that didn't have a home. <laughs> and these are um, down here are also from Target. I actually like these colors really well. This is my window. I have a little plant right here from like Sam's Club. And then over here, I love this room because I have space on either side of my bed. So whenever I have someone visiting, we both kind of have our own side of the bed. In my old apartment, the bed was against the wall, which I just hate. So love that about here. This is my nightstand table or whatever it's called. Um, I have this basket beneath here from TJ Maxx and I have my blankets in there. It's always freezing here. <laughs> and then above my table, I have this basket, which I got from Target and I just have my bro mount in there. This is like some pillow spray so that you spray it on your pillows before you go to bed and it's supposed to make you go to sleep. I don't know. Have my water bottle because I always drink water before I go to bed. And then I have my lamp. Honestly, this lamp does not match my theme of my room anymore, but I didn't want to like throw it away so whatever it's from target and then over here i just have my phone charger and my watch charger this is from hobby lobby it says blessed and then over here is where my closet is so um this is what my closet looks like up here i have my bag sinking from this thing from target and then here is she I have all my clothes hanging up obviously um, I try to just hang up my jackets and stuff like that, so that's that. Over here I have my drying rack, just chilling in here because I hang all my activewear. My obscene shoe addic addiction, um, mostly Adidas. <laughs> have my yoga mat, and then over here is where I store all my activewear. Excuse my messy sandals, those are just thrown in there. I really don't care, honestly, I don't wear them often, but whatever. Yoga block, dumbbells, but excuse the shoes down there. But then I have all of my activewear right here. I can go more in depth with how I kind of do it if you guys want, but it'd just be a quick video. So I don't know if you guys want that, but that is my active wear. And then up here on the top of my closet, I just have stuff like my foam rollers, baskets, with miscellaneous stuff in it, honestly, that has swimsuits in it, my lights, another bag that I should probably get rid of because I'm not going to use it <laughs> in my gym bag. So yeah, that is my closet. And then over here on the other side of my bed is my desk. So again, everything on my desk doesn't necessarily match the theme of my room, but I didn't really know what to do with the stuff, so I just kind of kept it. And I'm obviously not going to stay here forever, so whenever I move out into my more permanent home after school, I can like sell stuff if I don't want it anymore or anything like that. But on top of my desk, I have some cute little, like a gallery wall. So that amper stand really like, I loved it. That is from Kohl's. This is also from Kohl's, this little picture frame. I need a picture of my boyfriend and I to go in there because it says you and me, but I just haven't printed one because I've been really lazy. <laughs> then I have this clipboard calendar, which I DIY'd, this clock, which I DIY'd, and then over here, this is from Five Below. It's just a picture frame thing. Again, I threw away a lot of the pictures. I need to print out some more. I have this lamp here, which I've had since freshman year. I honestly don't like it, but it does its job. I like that it has outlets in here to plug my stuff in. So that's that. Then this is my top of my desk. I have a coaster over there. There's like a paper organizer, candle. This plant's from Ikea. I have my planner and my iPad and my laptop here. Desk chair. I forgot to mention beneath my beds, I have two sets of drawers. So some are there and then some are right here. I have clothes in there, obviously. And then behind my desk is my um, Ikea Alex drawer. So these are six. Alex drawers. I am hating this little gray thing here, which I tried to cover up with this wall hanging, which I DIY'd. Um, I, I followed a tutorial, so I'll try and find the video and link it down below. It's not perfect, but it works. <laughs> and then I have this thing here, which has my Q-tips and my cotton balls in there. And this thing obviously does not go here, but I got it and I didn't know where to put it, so I just put it here. I don't really know, y'all. I have my salt lamp, my jewelry, my keys, my headphones 
speaker on here. And then in here, I guess I'll show you guys real quick what's in here. Top drawer has all of my headbands. This is a Bath and Body Works receipt that I was hiding from you guys, so you guys didn't see it on top of here. Um, this one's like miscellaneous stuff, so like my camera chargers, mostly cords, my lighters for my um, candles. This is like my planner drawer, so all my stickers and washi tape. This is a school drawer full of stuff for school. And then this one is the drawer of my candles. And then like other stuff in Bath and Body Works, like lotion and stuff. So, yeah. Then, over here is my bathroom. I put on a cute outfit for you guys and you guys can't even see it. So, <laughs> love that for me. But this is my bathroom. Here is my sink. Um, I love that I have like a granite countertop, which I was looking at it earlier. And I think it might be fake because there is like, I can see the line somewhere on it. I don't really know, but... I like the look of it um i have my cute little sign this is from kohl's i have like a little tray these marble trays are from walmart and this is just like my contact stuff um this is also from walmart and then this uh hand soap um a little makeup mirror which i don't really use often and then this thing is awesome this is from amazon and you can plug multiple things in there so have that and I love this bathroom because it has drawers in it so this top drawer has like my everyday things this one has my hair stuff and the bottom one has like all of my contact stuff and then underneath the sink is kind of a mess but that's what it's looking like <laughs> these mats are from TJ Maxx I think and then this one I don't really like the look of it in here but I just wanted something to cover up the floor so for now this is where it is it was meant for my front door and didn't work there so it's here for now. We have my little towels hanging up. This one is from like TJ Maxx. And this is from Target, just decorative towels. Then here is my toilet. I have this coffee mascara hustle sign from Hobby Lobby. This is my laundry basket, which is from Ross. Then here I have this little basket full of my toilet paper, trash can, wipes to wipe your booty. You know that. <laughs> and then lastly, my shower. Well, behind my door have a hook hanging my towel and my hair towel then my shower looks like this um yep i need to wash that washcloth because my boyfriend's and he's not here anymore but yeah that is my shower i did install a different shower head because it's just so much easier to shower with one like that so you can clean the shower as well with it and then my shower curtain i need to wash because it's kind of dirty but that is from target so yeah all right y'all i really hope you guys enjoyed that video if you did give this video a thumbs up to let me know and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this i hope you guys liked it a lot and i'll see y'all in my next one bye